Hey, what's up, YouTube? Um, in this video, we're just going to be showing you the things that I ordered, like, I think a year ago. Almost a year ago. It was about whenever these came out. So, yeah, about a year ago. Um, they're called wearable shoe trees. Um, they came in a little package in the mail. I think you can only order them on online from uh, sneakle sh sneakle, uh, sneakershields.com. They got, like, I think they got white, black, pink, and, um, there's two, there's two different ones. It's called, I think, Universal and Protector. Um, they were out of the Protector whenever I was getting them, but I really wanted them for these, but as you can tell, I only use them for a bit. Well, uh, they still actually look pretty good, except they are a little bit wrinkled in the tube, toe box. Still didn't get that scratch out yet. I'll get it. But, um, yeah. These ones are the Universals. I got them white because they're all of every color. Like, they were sold out whenever I went there. So, um, as you can tell, like, I cut it off. Comes with a little pack telling you how to cut them and stuff. It's for, so your feet will feel comfortable. So this video is just going to be showing you how to put them in. And, um, like, yeah, how they work. So, um, I guess I'll just start this one. Try and do this with one hand. Alright, so, um, all you do is just find whichever one it is. I should tell you on the bottom. Let's see if the camera will focus in on it. Uh, yeah, right there. It says left, so... This is the right shoe. That's the wrong one. So you get this one it's for the right. So uh, all you're gonna do is this. You're just gonna get it and come to bend it. And it's it's kind of hard to do with one hand. And then, well, hold on. Let me let me just I'm not using my tripod today. All right. So all you do is this. Push it in there. It says to take the sole out. You can if you want to. I just don't because I find it easier not to. So, uh, you just push it in there as far as you can. Try to make it go to the very end. And then straighten it out. Push it in on the side. Straighten it out. And then once you do, here you go. Let's move my chair back. Alright. So, uh, there you go. There's one. This one has a sneaker shield, this one doesn't, as you can tell, you just watch me. Alright, so, um, I'm trying to figure out how to do this with one hand. Alright, so as you can see, I buffed them out a little bit, no more creasy crease on the toe box, I like this one. Yeah, they were, let me just kind of move it, alright. So this one doesn't have it and this one does. As you can tell, it pushed it out. Can't really see it no more. Except for right there. And this one you can tell that they've been worn a lot. And from the scratches you can tell too. But um yeah, so uh this can't really push it at all. Yeah, these things work really good, and they they're not too bad on your feet. They actually feel pretty good. Um, so yeah, they work really good. Um, but I would say to get the protectors instead of the universals because the protectors actually they're harder and they'll protect more. So um, yeah, this is my video on it. I hope it helped you. Like I said, I got it off of sneakershields.com. Um, they got different colors and everything. So um, go check them out. They're like, I think, I think it comes out to at least twenty something dollars for these. They're way better than the um, the uh, the ones that you get at Foot Locker and stuff. So yeah, thanks for watching this. See you later, YouTube.